Hey guys, today's video is about predicting players' movements in Tarkov. Before we get into more details, let's check out this clip of our boy Tony. Yo, can you guys chill? At this point, it's been about a minute into the game and I ran into the closest spawn, tried grenading them and running straight to resort. Tony spawned close to the scab rock near lighthouse extract and pushed the spawn immediately. This is what happens next. Moment of truth. Oh my god, it's actually there! Let's go! Clearly Tony was stoked about his find. Let's look at how it relates to this lesson. First, let's define routing. Routing is a set path that a PMC or person is going to usually take, also known as pathing. As you can tell from the clip, Routing can be very useful or detrimental based on how you use it. It could literally be a red card on the line. But predicting player movements in Tarkov isn't as difficult as you'd think, considering all the spawn points and how they rarely change. There are only a few set paths towards a point of interest from spawn, and knowing common routing practices will help you. Survive? Know where to look for early engagements? Understand a new layer of the game? And in some cases, help you figure out info on enemies late game? For part one of our series, we are going to be looking at Lighthouse. Here's a 3D map of Lighthouse with all the spawns circled and highlighted. If you're unfamiliar with spawns, I would suggest pausing between this photo and the next one. In this illustration, I highlighted the most common routes for every spawn. Generally, these routes are accurate for enemy PMCs that move towards a point of interest early in the game. Keep in mind that not everybody will take a common route. Hope the illustration is easy to understand. Spawn routes that flow into each other and will likely fight are marked by a red X. Otherwise, routes that approach a certain mountain range or stop on the map will either be perched in that area or will have moved into the objective that the flowchart is pointing towards. A good example of the perch play is a southern road spawn indicated by the purple circle on the bottom of the map. The spawn will generally perch up on the mountain and look to snipe at the green spawn as they head into lighthouse. And on the other hand, we have the brown spawn up in the top right of the map that will usually snipe the rogues and head into the base after that. The last thing I'd like to note is the white spawn. It's one of the only spawns left where you can move 5 to 10 steps and get an easy headshot angle on the brown spawn. Other than that, this concludes this video. If you guys would like to leave some feedback, I'd greatly appreciate it. And if you found this video useful, please subscribe as it helps us get more content out there. Thanks for watching.